touchdown in Helsinki. Donald Trump arriving at Finland's capital today, ahead of his summit tomorrow with Russian President Vladimir Putin. The sit-down coming just days after 12 Russian intelligence officers were charged by a federal grand jury for hacking the Democrats ahead of the 2016 U.S. presidential election. So what can we expect? Well, with the world watching, Trump is managing expectations in this new interview. What's your goal from the Putin meeting? Uh, I'll let you know after the meeting. I have absolutely, it was mutually agreed, let's have a meeting. I think it's a good thing for to meet. I do believe in meetings. Yeah. Nothing bad's going to come out of it, and maybe some good will come out. But I go in with low expectations. I'm not going with high expectations. I don't, uh, I don't really, I can't tell you what's going to happen. Trump, who was spotted playing golf today at his course in Scotland, has said he wants to raise nuclear arms control, Ukraine and Syria with Putin. But when it comes to asking the Russian president to extradite the 12 newly indicted Russians to the U.S., Trump telling CBS's Jeff Glor he hadn't thought of it, but he might. In the same interview that aired today, Trump revealing that he thinks the European Union, among others, is a foe when it comes to trade. Quick reaction coming from European Council President Donald Tusk, who tweeted, America and the EU are best friends. Whoever says we are foes is spreading fake news. Trump's trip to Helsinki follows his meetings in Brussels for the NATO summit, and then his first official visit to Britain as president. The stop saw Trump slam allies over defense spending, and then in London criticized British Prime Minister Theresa May over her handling of Brexit negotiations. Today, May, with a laugh, revealing the advice Trump shared with her. He told me I should sue the EU. Sue the EU? Sue the EU. Not go into negotiations, sue them. Actually... No, no. We're going, into, think about that we're, going to, second? we're going into negotiations with them. But interestingly, what the president also said at that press conference was, don't walk away. Yeah. Don't walk away from the negotiations because then you'll be then stuck. You're stuck. So I want us right. to be able to sit down to negotiate the best deal for Britain. One thing we can expect tomorrow, when Trump and Putin sit down for their first official summit, protests. In Helsinki today, thousands of demonstrators already taking to the streets. Happy 